Hello, Namaste. Welcome to the Distance Education organized by National Papson Kaski. And today I am here to teach you on the topic of how plants survive in nature. So, like animals, plants are also of different kinds. We can see different types of plants around us, like animal. Also, students, you know about that the habitat of the plants are different. Different plants we can find in different places, such as, uh, as an example, uh, let us take a plant of cactus, we can find in desert. So, habitat of cactus plant is desert. Similarly, that of pines, pine tree, we can find in cold mountain. Similarly, lotus plant, water lily, which are which we can find in water so their habitat is water the habitat are different from plant to plant so like animals plant are also different kinds some plants are big some are small okay uh, around our environment we can see different types of plants some are small and the some are big some plants grow in desert Plants like aloe vera, cactus, they grow in desert. Some grow in forest and also some plants grow in water. And their habitat are different. So, the plants that grow in desert cannot grow in water. Okay students, the plants that grow in desert cannot survive or grow in water because their habitat is different. So, a plant that grows in moist place also cannot grow in dry place. Okay? Uh, so, let us recall in previous class, uh, we discussed about, I think uh, we had lawn, you know about different types of plants. The plants are mainly divided into three parts, sorry, three groups. They are herbs, shrubs, and trees. So, students, uh, do you know what type of plants are called herbs? Okay, what type of plants are called herbs? Herbs. Okay, these are the plants having soft and delicate stem. So, those plants, these are the plants, these are the plants with soft and delicate stem. So, Herbs, this type of plants uh, which have soft, which means weak, soft, uh, this also meaning weak and delicate stem. And uh, their life cycle is uh, one year. And uh, some example are, can you tell some example? Some example of herbs are tomato plant, tomato plant, mustard, mustard. Other example, can you tell? Mustard, likewise barley, etc. They are the example of herbs. And the next one, next group of plant uh, that is uh, shrubs. Those plants, they are medium size. They are of medium size. They are not too small. Also, they are not too large. They are of medium size. So, those plants, uh, medium size and they are woody plants, taller than herbs and they are smaller than or shorter than tree 
So, how to define SARPs? Plants. These are the plants. Plants taller than. Taller than. Herbs. And shorter than shorter than trees okay this type of plants are we called shrubs plants taller than herbs and shorter than trees so can you tell some example they are also bushy in nature and uh, they have also many branches as an example this which plant lies in this group can you guess okay rose rose plant similarly other can you guess tulsi you know tulsi tulsi plant etc etc also lemon okay you can add here they are the some example of shrubs and the, they have uh, many branches then that of herbs so now next one next group of plant is trees trees okay trees are you know about trees they are the taller having a thick stem and the woody stem and the, some trees are used as a timber such as uh, to make furniture to make boat uh, to make our shelter sometime we also use to make our shelter etc they are big plants they have very thick woody and hard stem so they are the big plants trees are they are the big plants having thick and woody stem so they are the big plants having thick and woody stem and these such type of woody stem you can see here woody stem plants having a thick and woody stem the woody stem here we call trunk so this woody stem sometime we also call this is trunk we named is trunk so trunk sometime uh, question may ask in exam this is also may be asked so what is trunk may be asked in exam so trunk is the trees are considered of thick and woody stem and uh, this is called trunk you can write answer like this and uh, can you give uh, some example of trees can you give okay you know about that trees some example are such as maple tree other also you can eat pine pine tree mango tree etc okay these are the some example of trees so trees are considered of thick and woody stem uh, beside this herb shrubs and trees in our nature there are other types of plants they are climbers and creepers so uh, let us discuss about climbers and creepers so the first one is
Climbers. Climbers. And uh, students, uh, do you know climbers? In our nature, in our environment, we can see so many climbers. And uh, they need support to stand. Climbers, they need support. They need support. They take support of other things to stand. So they are more advanced than creepers. The climbers are more advanced. They are much more advanced than that of creepers. And uh, they have long and weak steam. They have long and weak steam. So how to define climbers? Now the plants which need support to stand. Okay, plants. Plants which need which need support to stand to stand is called climbers. So, can you give uh, some example of climbers? One time thing we can see different types of so many climbers in our nature such as uh, money plant you know money plant which needs support to stand similarly cucumber plant also need support to stand similarly peas beans etc they are the some example of climbers so some example are peas, grapes, grapes plant, money plant, money plant, etc. These are the some example of climbers and they need support to stand. They cannot stand themselves. They need support of other things to stand. And the some example are here. They are peas, grapes, money plant, etc. Okay, students. And now our next group of plant is creepers. Creepers. Uh, students, uh, do you know about creepers? The name is enough for creepers definition. Creepers, which means creep on the ground. This two plants are on ground ma, zamin ma creep garne kam garda sa. Zamin mathi mathi inne kam garda sa on the surface of ground these are the those type of plants which uh, creep on the ground and they have thin and long stem the creepers they have thin and long stems so plants how to define creepers plants having plants having thin and long stem and creep creep on the ground are called creepers so creepers are the plants having thin and long stem and creep on the ground so this type of plants are we called creepers and uh, they can neither stand nor support their body so creepers neither can support their body 
not they can stand so creepers bhane ko testo khalgo tini haru le na ta afno body la stand garna saksa na ta tini haru le afno weight lai nai usle dhanna saksa testo type ko la hami haru le creepers bhanera bhanne garinchha okay uh, in our surrounding so there are different types of plants in our nature and uh, they survive uh, for different life span they have different life span some can survive some plants can survive for long time many years and the some plants are seasonal they can just seen only in some seasons and the sun for a short period of time so now i'm going to tell you what is the habitat so let us discuss about habitat i think uh, you know about habitat i think in class 2 class 3 you had learn about what is habitat the plants habitat can you guess what will be the plants habitat the plants habitats are land maybe one of the habitat water sometime desert desert is also part of a land cold mountain hot places etc they are the habitat of a plant so plants are found in different habitats like animals is compared that of animals also the habitat of animals is different similarly the plants habitats are also different from plants to plants so plants of land now i'm going to teach you the topic plants of land our new topic is plants of plants of land there are different types of land habitat of plant we can see desert desert is extremely high place you know about that similarly we can see dry land this is also habitat of a plant we can see cold mountain this is also habitat of plant so land is the habitat of plants most of the plants most of the big plants they grow in land when you think about the habitat of plant we think about just land land is the habitat of a plant but not that we can find out many plants in water okay so habitat are different varies from plants to plants so there are different types of land on the earth such as we can see desert we can see ordinary dry place we can see wet land similarly we can see sandy land etc some places are warm yes some are hot warm some places are hot and some places are cold also some part of land are cold different types of plants grow on different lands okay i like to give you some homework you can copy homework the first question is what are herbs right any two examples 
write any two examples similarly the next question is what are trees write any three examples and the last one what is strong what is strong okay this much for today students we will meet in our next class thank you bye bye